My father and mother were both 46, and they had left, led a life with two world wars actually, and that left them, they didn't love each other anymore. That reflected on my whole life, I think. Mm. That might be part of the cause of me being lost for many, many years. Because I think that the first years of a child are of vital importance for when he grows up and what he becomes later. Mm. Because that, me that memory of, of that thing is built into his bones almost, in the memory of his whole body. Yeah that is built in and that will come out later in all kinds of ways and in my case I started uh, searching and searching and searching I didn't live with my parents, I lived with a couple of moany people of what? Moany people. They were always moaning about that. <laughs> so when I came home at six o'clock at night or five o'clock, whatever it was, the only thing they did was eat and moan about life. And so every evening I just went upstairs, goodbye. And then after six years I said, I'm going to leave and you will never see me back. And that's what I did. So you never saw your parents back? Yes, once. I was transported to the hospital in Leiden, mm. academic ziekenhuis, and then uh, I was on this enormous machine because I couldn't breathe anymore. I didn't know anything about life whatsoever, I was gone as far as I was concerned, and then I woke up and I looked into my parents' eyes. <laughs> I hadn't seen them for years. Mm. I just started vomiting while I was on this machine. So the nurse said, you'd better go to, to your parents. parents. Yeah, and I never saw them again. I looked at it, I looked at the theme. That's Erich Fromm, uh, Liefhebben en Kunstenkunde, The Art of Loving, hmm. was based on that book. Yes. I said, that was the first book about love that I've ever read. Ah. For me, that was the Bible. The Bible of love. <laughs> in that period, I, I read it six times or something. Okay. I fell in love with the with book. book. I might say that I, when I first read the book, I was just discovering it. Mm. And through the years, more and more, I started developing it myself. And in the end, yeah, I'm quite capable of uh, feeling love and giving love, mm. receiving love. But it's a long development. Yeah. It took a whole lifetime to get there. So this the thing about more with his workshops was about actually exactly what I had been doing all those years, developing love. Mm. 